Hey, what's up, Harvest House family? Marshall here. I hope and pray that you are doing well. I am releasing a new instrumental worship video, and today I'll be playing the handpan. Handpans are percussive instruments made out of steel. I build them, and I also occasionally play them for Sunday morning services. But before I do that, I wanted to share just a short encouraging word with you guys that the Lord has given me this week. You know, in the midst of all this upheaval and uncertainty, I've really wanted to practice being in the presence of God wherever I happen to be. Here at home, outside, with my family, eating our meals together. Um, and, you know, I know that a lot of us have been ripped out of the normal routine schedules that we're used to. So I've been rereading a book that's really influential to me. It's called Practicing the Presence of God by Brother Lawrence. And I just wanted to read you this to offer an encouragement for you guys as you're going throughout your week. So he says, But remembering him, praising him, asking for his grace, offering him your troubles, or thanking him for what he has given you will console you all the time. During your meals or during any daily work, lift your heart up to him, because even the least little remembrance will please him. You don't have to pray out loud. He's nearer than you can imagine. It isn't even necessary that we stay in church in order to remain in God's presence. We can make our hearts personal chapels where we can enter any time to talk to God privately. These conversations can be so loving and anyone can have them. Is there any reason not to begin? Those who have the wind of the Holy Spirit in their souls glide ahead even while they sleep. If the vessel of our soul is still being tossed by winds or storms, we should wake the Lord who has been resting with us all along, and he will swiftly calm the sea. God bless you guys.